In this video, I'm going to guide you through how to use consent forms with Clinipad. First of all, we need to set this up for our users. And to start with, we need to add a new tab to their charting area. And we can do this by going into the chart section, clicking on the spanner, going to select which tabs you use in the activity area, clicking next and moving consents from left to right. We'll now see the consent tab there. Now we have the tab. We want to set up the forms ready to use. And we do that by clicking on the spanner at the bottom right. So first time you enter it, the screen will be empty. So to add a template, you simply click plus one. Add a name for the template and add a body. This is the text you will want them to see and sign. Something like that. We click save. And as you can see from here, you can add as many templates as you want. You can simply just click plus one. You can edit any templates or you can delete any templates. So now the templates are set up, let's have a look at how this works. So you can see this patient here is coming for an extraction under sedation. So the dentist will go down to the consents tab and click on the sign consents button. And you can decide whether to have a general consent form or whether you can actually sign it to that particular course of treatment by using the drop down box here. You can select up to four different consent forms to sign at any one time. But as you can see, when I do do more than four, the send button goes away. You can do a maximum of four. And for this example, I'm going to choose extraction and sedation. And I'm going to send that to my device and click send. On the device itself, we can now see the two forms that we have sent there. So we'll go through each one of these with the patient. I'm going to start with sedation. And you can see, first of all, any logo um, or address information that you have on your header, similar to your estimates or the terms and conditions. Um, we have the title and we also have the text that you have uh, asked them to sign. So they can read through this. And if they're happy to sign, they just click on the sign button, top left there. And then they just do a signature, click send. And you can now see the signature on there. We simply just click done. And we can see the tick on that consent form. So we're just going to move on to extraction there. And we're just going to sign that as well. And once the patient has signed those two forms, we can go back into exact. And just like the estimates, we'll go up to the ClinicPad button here, click on that down arrow and say to return the device. This will then add those two forms to the consents area here. You can see they attached itself to the course of treatment and the user as well, along with the date. And we can now double click these to view the actual form itself, which will come in a PDF format, just like all your other forms that are in the system. And you can see the signature there. And just like all the other forms, this is in your data folder and will be backed up with any other documents. Just to show you, you can just view the other template as well. You can view, obviously view those at any time. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, please contact our support team who will be more than happy to help.